Hello, I'm Captain Stacy Spell, Commanding Officer of Media Relations Division of the Los Angeles Police Department. This critical incident community briefing is intended to provide you with information about a head strike with an impact device that occurred in Hollywood Division in the City of Los Angeles on March 13, 2021 at around 9.29 p.m. You're about to see relevant video footage and learn about other evidence and police procedures related to the case so you can have a better understanding of what occurred based on what we know right now. The LAPD conducts very thorough use of force investigations, which typically require investigators to interview multiple witnesses, view numerous hours of video footage, and analyze a significant amount of forensic evidence. We are still at the very early stages of this investigation, which can often take up to a year to complete, and our understanding of the incident may change as this additional evidence is collected, analyzed, and reviewed. We also do not draw any conclusions about whether the officers acted consistent with our policies and the law until all the facts are known and the investigation is complete. A word of caution, the images and information you're about to see may be disturbing. When a police officer uses force to arrest a suspect or defend against an attack, it can be graphic and difficult to watch. In addition, there may be strong language used by those shown in the video. Viewer discretion is advised, especially for young children and sensitive viewers. On the afternoon of March 13, 2021, Several hundred protesters gathered for a march in the Hollywood area. At around 9.26 p.m., a request for additional police personnel at Vine Street and Lexington Avenue was broadcast due to a large crowd of protesters that had overtaken that intersection. Hi, Hollywood Unit of 415 Group, 6201 Hollywood Boulevard, to 6100, 200 protesters, juveniles and adults, on Hollywood towards Highland. Code 2, Incident 3935, already 637. As additional officers arrived in the area and formed into skirmish lines, Several protesters began launching fireworks and throwing objects at the officers, resulting in a call for help. Air 16 officers are requesting help at Vine and Lexington for a 450 crowd. While at the intersection of Vine Street and Lexington Avenue, officers used beanbag shotguns and other less lethal munitions to target individuals who were throwing objects at officers such as rocks, metal rods, glass bottles, frozen water bottles, and explosive devices. Officers observed the suspect throw a metal box at officers standing on the skirmish line. At the same time, an officer on the skirmish line that was equipped with a less lethal device fired a beanbag round at that suspect and inadvertently struck the suspect in the head. The metal box thrown by the suspect struck two officers on the line. That suspect was later identified as 27-year-old Benson Williams. Here's a cell phone video from a witness at scene. I can't hang with Shots fired by police. Be careful with what you do not stop because there's a world watching you. The beanbag shotgun is a Remington 870 shotgun, which has been configured with a green slide handle and stock, rifled barrel, and side saddle ammunition holder. The color green is used to signify that the shotgun is for the sock round only, not lethal munitions, and designed to fire a cloth sock filled with small metal pellets. The primary target area is the navel area or belt line. Officers may target the suspect's arms, hands, or legs when practical. Body-worn video cameras are used by most officers assigned to field duties. They're worn at chest level and capture a general perspective within line of sight from that angle. The angle of the camera prohibits viewers from seeing everything the officer saw and experienced. Upon activation, both audio and video will turn on. However, body-worn video cameras have a buffer of video without audio from the previous two minutes prior to activation. This feature is designed to capture incidents that occur suddenly where an officer doesn't immediately activate the camera. Here's the body-worn video from the officers involved in this incident. Move, move, move. Get out, get out. We're engaging the crowd now. Shoot them if you have it. Hey, get on the line. Let's make it a health call. Watch it. 
Okay, you're okay, you're okay. You're okay, you're okay. 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 you are okay 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 you